think you could loan me some cash for a flight to Space Cliff? Uh, yeah, no problem. I'll look at the piggy bank. Might not be much. I'm simply preparing for the inevitable commercial space flight sector that seems to be developing more and more every day. Virgin Galactic revealed the initial design of a passenger spacecraft, which they aim to fly at speeds in excess of Mach 3. Uh, do you know what Mach 3 is? Turns out it's not just a men's razor. News of the spacecraft design follows the recent agreement between Virgin and Rolls-Royce to build supersonic engines similar to the ones used on the Concorde. Test flights are expected as early as 2023. Do you want bite-sized daily news stories? Do you? If so, smash that subscribe button and be sure to like this video. Please contain your excitement for the new Warzone Season 5 launch. The Season 5 update is now available to download on PC, PS4, and Xbox One just ahead of the actual launch. Although the game's update requires 90 gigs of free space to install, Modern Warfare's production director Paul Hale said, quote, the download will be big, but the overall size of the game will actually shrink on your consoles after you download the patch. So I feel like there's a pool joke in here somewhere. I was in the pool. <laughs> this time we are jumping to the prison and don't spend a dime until we save for the load down. Do you still have your pet spider, Cliff? Oh yeah, Bartholomew, he's back at the house. Well, if you're looking to add another to your collection, look no further than the Joker spider, which was recently discovered by the scientists in Iran. The colors on the back of the arachnid are very similar to that of the classic comic book villain, uh, but I'd still rather run into the Joker in a dark alley. The Loridia phoenixi, how was that? Good, All right. it's about 0.3 inches long and comes from a larger unique family of spiders. So I know what you're thinking, what makes them unique, right? <laughs> That's a great question, and thanks for the setup. Um, arachnologists love the family of spiders because they tend to cooperate in building communal nests and collectively caring for their young. It's a super weird planet. Are you afraid of spiders, Cliff? Um, you know, I don't want one in my bed, let's just say that. Good answer, same. So three mariners were rescued in the Pacific Islands by writing SOS in the sand. The phrase comes from Morse code and translates to save our ship. The three men had set out on a 23-foot boat last Thursday before running out of fuel and landing on a tiny island called Piccolo, which was about 120 miles short of their intended destination. Have you ever been to that part of the world, Cliff? No, I've been to Hawaii, that's the closest, but I do want to go to the island someday. There are about 10,000 Pacific Islands throughout the region, so it's not too surprising that they found land. At least the three men had each other's company, or they would have had to resort to conversations with a volleyball. Wilson! Wilson! Are you a fan of Always Sunny in Philly? Of course, I wrote this story. The offbeat comedy just hit its 15 year anniversary and has launched the careers of its cast members, including Charlie Day, Glenn Howerton, and Caitlin Olsen. TV Line posted a fantastic article highlighting the top 15 worst things the gang had done over their run. What's your favorite scheme from the gang? Oh, definitely when Frank gets caught in the uh, kids' playground equipment. Whether it's their own twisted version of Extreme Home Makeover or tricking Dee into thinking she's a success, the laughs never end. Season 15 is expected to air in 2021 on FXX. Maybe you and I should head up to South Dakota for the annual biker rally in Sturgis, where an expected 250,000 people will gather despite virus concerns. The city has a local population of about 7,000 and has grown to expect the tourism dollars every year, which have been as much as 800 million. What do you say we get tattoos, rent a hog, and drive up there for the festivities, Cliff? As long as they're matching butterflies. <laughs> Some residents believe holding the festival is a huge mistake. For more on the festival or biker culture in general, please check out Cliff's Instagram. Are you still avoiding crowds? Yeah, absolutely. I'm not going anywhere. Good for you. Very respectful man. Thanks for tuning in to The Little Bit Show, the best daily news show on YouTube. If you like the show, make sure to like this video and subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to download our app. It's pretty awesome. Thanks for tuning in to The Little Bits, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye. See ya.